Hello again. In this video we are going to discuss the concept of layering objects in Easy Builder Pro. So, let's get started. The way Easy Builder Pro handles layering is very similar to most other graphic development systems. Layering simply means the order that your objects are stacked in. Now obviously this now is on the top layer and over here on the home tab uh, we've got in our alignment tools area here we've got our our layering interface so right now we're at the top layer I could send that to the bottom layer um, I could bring it up to the next layer and so on and so forth so there's a couple of ways that we handle layering in Easy Builder Pro. Of course, there is the layering of the objects that are on your current screen, on the actual physical screen you're working with. Now, of course, we do also have uh, embedded windows that can be layered, as well as underlay windows that can be placed in the layer stack. Take a direct window for example. I happen to have a direct window on my clipboard. So I'll paste it in here along with a button to uh, display it. Uh, and this window is just uh, displaying uh, window 23. So now this, as far as uh, layering goes, any layering that's displayed on this screen will take the attributes of this screen's layers. So if I were to place this over top of these objects and make sure that it's on the top layer, you can see that it will cover up these, these objects. And then, of course, any, any layering attributes there were in the window being displayed, of course, would, would maintain their own layers. Now, we also have a way to display underlay windows. And so we want to go to focus on our actual window base here. And then we can select our, our underlay windows. Now these are actually in layers as well. So uh, on the underlay windows, the only thing displayed from the underlay is the objects in the window. So I made some, some other windows here to display. I've got a bottom, a middle, and then a top and um, and so these are how these underlay objects will be layered <clears throat> so you can see the uh, bottom window is beneath the middle window and the middle window is beneath the top window These three layers are, they begin the top layer of the underlay is going to be below the bottom layer of the primary window. So we cannot place any objects behind these underlay. They're, they sort of act like a background. So I'm sure you can imagine how using different combinations of underlay windows and layering them differently can create many different backgrounds for your project. Well, that's the ins and outs of layering. Thanks for watching and be sure to come back and see more of our instructional videos.